A team of scientists have found organic soil that has been frozen to the bottom of the Greenland ice sheet for 2.7 million years. The discovery, led by Paul Bierman, professor of geology at the University of Vermont, provides strong evidence that the ice sheet is older than previously thought, and that it's lasted through many periods of global warming. Greenland is a place of particular interest to scientists and policymakers. Its ice sheet contains more than 600,000 square miles of ice, making it the second largest body of ice on Earth. At two miles deep and roughly the size of Alaska, the ice sheet could have a significant influence on how fast and how high global sea levels may rise as a result of climate change. If it fully melts, that's enough water to raise global sea levels 23 feet by many estimates. Knowing the history of the Greenland ice sheet helps scientists better predict its and the world's future. The new study, published in the journal Science, indicates Greenland actually was green millions of years ago, looking much like the Alaskan tundra. But if the current ice sheet has survived other phases of global warming and hasn't changed much in the entire time that humans have been a species, does that mean we shouldn't worry about climate change? The scientists warn that the edge of Greenland's ice sheet actually is melting quickly, and Professor Bierman says global temperatures are on a path to be far warmer than during the entire period the ice sheet has existed. If we keep on our current trajectory, the ice sheet will not survive, he said in a statement. And once you clear it off, it's really hard to put back on.